70th World Series of Drag Racing here at Cordova Dragway. What you just saw was Ulf Leanders go number one at a 5.52 elapsed time for the Professional Alcohol Drag Racing Series. They have brought in Top Alcohol Funny Car to the World Series along with a star-studded show for this historic event in the world of drag racing. Ulf was able to remain the quickest of all the Alki floppers here at the World Series in the second session with a 5.55. Ulf Leanders, now you are accustomed to running well and being number one qualifier, but number one qualifier of the World Series, that's gotta be a special one to mark off in your career. Oh yeah, you've never been here to Cordoba before and uh, it's, it's really good here, really nice. Uh, you know, grandstands are full, you know, a lot of people, and uh, just great. You got number one with a 52. In the last session, you went a 55. Take us into the cockpit. What's the difference between a 52 and a 55 in one of these top alcohol funny cars? Uh, 52 was a pretty nice run. It just went down there pretty much in the groove and did what's, what it's supposed to do. 55 was actually pretty, uh, the run was actually pretty the same as the 52 but I did two mistakes first of all I rolled in a little bit deep and that shaved about a hundred off uh, of the ET when I rolled too deep into stage uh, second thing I did was I came a little bit out of the groove the car was skating around pretty hard there up at the top end and uh, that shaved a couple of hundreds off so um, the runs were pretty much identical just uh, you know it's just me as a driver Ulf Landers, number one qualifier for the PADR on alcohol. The Professional Alcohol Drag Racing Series, the PADR, is new to you as a drag racing fan and new in the drag racing world. Very simply, for like Ray Drew with his Top Alcohol Funny Car combination, they're giving Top Alcohol Funny Car racers another place to race. And with this distinction, some better payouts, more racing, also, better treatment, all the while doing it in the quarter mile. So, make sure you take the time to follow on Instagram and X elsewhere, right here including the Monday Morning Racer, to follow the action of the Professional Alcohol Drag Racing Series, the PADR. More action you can expect from the 70th World Series of Drag Racing here at Cordova Dragway. I'm Lee Kraft, the Monday Morning Racer.
sure if you follow Top Alcohol Funny Car, you are familiar with the SeaTech Manufacturing Top Alcohol Funny Car, K and K Racing, the Hool Brothers, but they're also the masterminds behind the P A D R. Why for this for funny car racers and alcohol racers? Well, Lee, we have to we have to take some different roads here to bring this class back to where it was even you know 10 or 20 years ago. We have to get young people involved. And I think a mixture of these professionals out here who have been doing it forever, uh, you know, get Sean Bellamers involved with the program, Chris, uh, Shane Westerfield, I'm sure would want it to come to a few races. Uh, you know, hopefully Anders, there's, a, there's a, a big group of talent here that you know, if we can get some younger people involved, we can help them with tune-ups, we can help them with driving, and we can get them excited about these cars. And we have to attack this from a financial standpoint. No longer can we just go broke doing this. We have to work with tracks at these special events where we can bring sponsors in, they can bring a lot of people in, they can see alcohol funny car racing, and we can show sponsors alcohol funny car racing and make that pay. The turnaround is complete for Ray Drew and this top alcohol funny car team. They are going into the final to face Ulf Leanders. Ray Drew has mentioned that there are some bumps here at Cordova that has presented a challenge for him in his hot rod. And those bumps even caused him to drift to the center line. In qualifying, he actually took out a block. We will see if Ray Drew in the Mustang has got enough oomph to take out Ulf. Awning says we've got you covered and well they're going to cover Ray Drew we'll talk about that in just a moment but Ray Ulf Leanders turned on the red light that qualified you and solidified you with the wind light here at the PA DR event at the World Series yeah it was unbelievable I feel sorry for Ulf I mean he had the car to beat all weekend I want to thank uh, DMP Awnings for supporting this whole event. It's awesome. It's fun. And uh, we were uh, chasing our tail a little bit this weekend, but uh, we made the rounds and we made it to the final. And sometimes you got to be lucky. And that was my day. Certainly was. Speaking of being lucky, you won the raffle amongst the competitors to get a new DMP Awnings over there for your pit you and the crew can work in the shade a little easier now. Yeah, how about that? It's my lucky day, and they gotta go play the lottery. So on the draw, they pulled my name out. I'm like, wow, unbelievable. I really thank Dean Dubbin from DMP Awnings. It's, I mean, what he does for the sport is unbelievable. Ray Drew here at the World Series wins the professional alcohol drag racing competition. It's Sunday here at the 70th World Series of Drag Racing at Cordova Dragway. And the big show racing has concluded, including the PADR and the top alcohol funny car competitors within. There were four cars that showed up to compete. The Van Howens, they had an issue with connecting rods, deciding to make an untimely exit from their proper position. And that had three cars going into eliminations. Now, I know many of you watching would say only four showed up and only three were able to go into eliminations, but I think for the PADR, this was a successful event. They were able to have their first rounds of eliminations. They were able to crown their first event champion in Ray Drew, and they were able to showcase what they want to accomplish, and that is bringing Top Alcohol Funny Car to grand stages in drag racing and showcase those that compete in Top Alcohol Funny Car as professionals, which many of them truly are. I think it's been a successful event for the Professional Alcohol Drag Racing Series. They have plans 
to go into 2025, to bring Top Alcohol Funny Car to more venues, to more shows, and to give those competing the right treatment. It's been an honor to be here at the World Series of Drag Racing and to cover Top Alcohol Funny Car in the PADR. I'm Lee Kraft for the PADR right here on the Monday Morning Racer YouTube channel.